Let's talk about the magnetic induction due to infinitely long straight conductor which is carrying current. Considering I got a very large straight conductor XY which is passing a current of I and there is a point P which is of distance almost A from the conductor. AB is a small element of length DL and theta is the length or angle between the straight conductor and a line which is connecting P. As you know, according to the bayat savet law, the magnetic induction at point P due to the current element I into DL is dB is equal to mu0 into 4 pi into I into DL sin theta by R square. As you know, the triangle, the angle theta of phi psi, which is OPA, and the angle of A, P, and B is D psi. From the triangle ABC, sin theta is equal to opposite side by hypotenuse, which indicates. AC divided by AB. So, as you know, AB is replaced by DL. So, AC is equal to DL sin theta. And from triangle APC, you got AC is equal to RD pi B psi. Equating equations 2 and 3, you got RD psi is equal to DL sin theta. Substituting DL sin theta with the RD psi in Biot Savit law, you got mu naught into 4 pi into I into RD psi by R square. Telling R and R square here, you got the answer as mu naught into 4 pi 4 by 4 pi into I into D psi by R. Whereas in triangle O, P, A, cos theta cos psi is equal to adjacent side by hypotenuse. This is our adjacent side and this is our hypotenuse. So A by R and R equal to A by cos psi. Substituting the equation in equation 5, you got mu0 by 4 pi replacing r with a, a by cos phi, you will get this equation. Manipulating the ma total magnetic induction of P due to the conductor xy is minus psi1 to psi2 and its db. You got mu naught into i by 4 pi a cos i into d psi with the integration of with an integration of minus psi 1 to psi 2. So as you know cos i into d psi will become sin theta or some sin psi. Substituting psi with psi 1 and psi 2 you got psi 2 minus of sin sin of minus psi 1 which will become plus so minus here minus here will become plus here so this is the final equation we receive let's move on to a simple condition that for infinitely long conductor the angle is 90 degree. So sin 90 degree plus sin 90 degree which is 1 which is equal to 2. So telling this 2 and 4 you got mu naught into i by 2 pi a. If the conductor is placed in a medium of permeability mu it will become mu naught will become mu into i by 2 pi a where b is the r medium 
mu naught is the permeability medium, I is the current and A is the distance.